How you doing? Yes, sir. <laughs> now I owe you a lot of interviews, bro. I ignored you because I was just like, no. <laughs> and the other dude is just kind of rude. So. What's up, guys? What's up? What's oh, up, man? Nick? Not much, man. You know, it's, that guy came and fight, man. Yeah. I was like, dude, you're a, you're a tough SOB. He's like, man, it was just it was an honor to be in there with you. I was, he goes, man, I didn't think I was gonna get past the first. I was like, why'd you keep going, bro? <laughs> but I was just playing with him, man. He's yeah. like, you know, he's one of a heck of a fighter, man. He's tough. He hit pretty decent, man. So, you know, it's uh, it's one of those things. Where I was telling, I don't like I don't like making excuses. That's not my thing. You know what? Uh, in three years though, I have only fought twice. You know, first one went three rounds. This one went eight. Um, you know, obviously there's a lot of rust within me, and uh, that's like, again, that's another excuse of many. But uh, I just uh, I'm just happy to be back in the ring. You know. I'm gonna have to go ice my hands though, cause uh, I can feel them all. The... Victor, that was my next question. How did how did the hands hold up? Yeah, they're. Uh, it's the first time I've actually had pain in my hands like that, but uh, they're kind of throbbing right now. It's probably my fault because, like, I usually tighten my own hands at the gym, and uh, I don't let the coaches tighten. What, what about what about the wrist though? Oh no no, great man. The wrist is nice. It held up nice. Yeah, I, there's no uh, no pain whatsoever. Uh, I think maybe just the knuckles a little. You were able to move them around a lot in the ring, but. Did you at any point, were you hurt or fatigued of any kind? No, 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 no. More than anything, I was kind of like, dang, man, I'm, I'm trying to do things that I've done in the past, you know, with small, with gloves, and I just, uh, it's been so long. How did it feel being back in the ring after a year? It was great, man. It was a, an awesome feeling. A little nerve-wracking here and there, but uh, it was good, ultimately. Thank Having you. said that, I mean, how do you feel as far as, you know, uh, we know you're an action-packed guy, you know, you like to, you know, you hit hard and you like to throw a lot of punches. Yeah, but like to bang it out. Exactly. But with, with your, you know, your past, you know, with the John, with Jose Cito Lopez and all of that, do you kind of find yourself now a little bit more hesitant? Oh, no, no, no. It's in the past for a reason, you know. Matter of fact, uh, after this fight, you know, I, I figure, why not go for a uh, the winner of, of Guerrero and, and Danny Garcia, you know? I mean, that's just me. That, and also, I hear, I hear Jose Cito Lopez is talking quite a bit, so, I mean, I like to do what I did to him before, but this time ended. I mean, the last time you got a lottery ticket, you know? It's not every day you can wake up and go break somebody's jaw How do you see while this? you're losing the whole fight. Now, right? now you got a guy like Joel Diaz, you know, in your corner, uh, who's highly respected. How do you see him in your corner helping you? What is he teaching you maybe to be a little bit more safe, but still? You know, in this camp, it's been a, it's not just Coach Joel Diaz, you know? It's a Coach Joel Diaz, it's obviously he's the head, he's the lead. That's the boss overall, but then we have Coach Antonio Diaz. He's been through many wars, he knows what it's like. We have Coach Jose Rodriguez, you know? These guys are with me 24 seven every day. And of course, I, I get a foot up, <laughs> I get on the nerves sometimes. <laughs> but it's pretty awesome, you know? Um, other than that, I just I think it's a, it's a great asset to have this kind of pe these kind of people in my corner. Yeah. How do you, how do you not get ahead of yourself to where you said it? You want to get back to the elite level, but where you know that you know what this is the beginning. It's gonna. It, be it's strong. a simple simple thing, really. You know, in the past, I always saw, found myself jumping the gun. Thanks to the coaches here, Vic, you need to slow down, man. You need to slow down, bro. Well, I want to fight this. Vic, slow it down, man. Seriously, you need to ground yourself. Slow it down. You you know you have you have been. You've been inactive for almost three years. Would you consider so, this yeah. a step forward uh, to, to the direction where you ultimately want to be? Absolutely. You know, uh, I definitely walked away from Hollywood for a while. And how do you assess your performance tonight? Uh, overall? I, my, I'm my own personal worst critic, you know. I scored myself very low tonight. Coaches were happy, um, but that's not enough for me. What is it that you didn't like about yourself? Just a lot, you know. My timing was a little off. Uh, my reflex, it was good, but I don't know why. I don't know. Do you attribute that to uh, inactivity? I believe so. Yeah. Yeah. Absolutely. You got a guy who's been fighting every other weekend or every every you know month, every two months. I mean, they're obviously going to be you know more elusive in there and whatnot. How was the conditioning holding up tonight? Oh, Did good. You feel any conditioning was great. Conditioning was great. But you know, obviously, conditioning as opposed to just boxing in, in itself. I go to a gym and I'm not the type of guy that can go in and spar eight, ten rounds right off the bat. You put me in there for two or three. I'm like, oh, get me out of here. Get me out of here. But I could work out. I could, you know, work out nice and, and stay in there for hours. But I can't box for hours. You know, I have to work myself into that 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 way of being. You know. How did so, you feel being on PBC for the first time? That was great, man. I, I must thank uh, Al Heyman, Sam Watson, and PBC for this opportunity, man. I, you know, I, I'm only I'm very excited because I feel like I got I have a whole new chance to do something I did in the past. So. When do you plan on, on returning? Do you want to stay active? How active? Oh, bro, next week, man. <laughs> Congratulations, Victor, on behalf Absolutely. of Dr. Thank you, Thank you very much, guys. And uh, 
Oh, you submitted yourself.